joining me. I'm Katie Pertie of katiepertiedesigns.com and the designer for 49 and Market. And I want to show you my latest collection designed for 49 and Market, the Vintage Artistry Countryside Collection. I'm going to start with the paper pack and it is a 12 by 12 collection pack of eight double-sided papers and there is a different design on each page. So we'll start with the cover page and you get a fussy cut sheet on the back. Lots of butterflies, sunflowers, newsprint, various ephemera. And then this sheet is called Radiance and it's got some of my botanicals, lots of layers of newsprint and paint and texture. And on the back side, it's kind of a tonal textured solid with some lace and newsprint and type. This sheet is called Sunny Days. Lots of sunflowers and painted botanicals and a little bumblebee. And on the back side is a gingham painted with newsprint and seed catalog images. And at the bottom here, you get a nice little red gingham strip. So you don't want anything to go to waste. Next up, we have Sunset Bloom. Vibrant yellow background with botanicals and butterflies. All painted and ready for you to create all kinds of wonderful things. And on the back side is, again, kind of like a painted solid textured. You can see there's some chicken wire texture in there, some newsprint and green and yellow. And across the bottom is a strip of ephemera. Next up is Golden Fields. This is a sunflower paper with a gingham and newsprint, hand-drawn sunflowers in there, little bumblebees. And on the back side is a newsprint. Really versatile, gotta love a newsprint. And a word strip across the bottom. Next paper is Countryside Farm Life with roosters and chickens. There's some maps, all kinds of texture. And on the back side is a tonal green, again with type and newsprint and lots of depth to it. Here we have Countryside Gaggle, because we have a gaggle piece. We've got the little geese and the gingham, more hand-drawn sunflowers, and a botanical cluster across the top. And on the back side is a red gingham with again, some seed catalog images and artsy paint. Then we have Countryside Homestead, one of my favorites. I love the cluster on the left-hand side. It came together so nicely and I think it's so versatile with the sunflowers, botanicals, the rooster, butterflies, bees and another botanical cluster in the upper right-hand corner. And on the back side of this is a painted texture. It's not really a solid, but it's um, you know, very subtle. I say subtle through the middle here. And then we've got some yellow and green, red. And our last page is Countryside Grange all the fields and the advertisements all painted together. And on the back side, whoops, that's just gunk, not on the paper. The back side is a textured black. So if you can see it, it kind of looks like chalkboard. That was the intention. I think it's a great foundation. All right, so that is our 12 by 12 collection pack. In this, we also have our six by eight papers. And as usual, our six by eight packs have nine different designs with three each and a fussy cut sheet. So I'm gonna go through the nine different designs with you. 
We have horizontal formats and then a textured. Again, another horizontal design with the sunflowers and a textured solid background. You can go either direction on that one. And again, we've got, um, this one's a vertical. I have the countryside mixed with newsprint. And on the back is painted with the chicken wire and the watercolor. Here we've got the roosters and the chickens and that lovely black tonal chalkboard. Our rooster backed with sunflowers. Whoops. And we've got another sunflower design backed with the newsprint and the botanical here with a green tonal painted background. Another botanical for you. Such a fun collection. And then here's a horizontal of the rooster and botanicals and the geese and botanicals. And the back is the red gingham. And then we have our fussy cut sheet. We've got sunflowers, seed catalogs, tickets, sentiments, and an extra of the chalkboard background. All right, so that is our papers for Countryside. Now we also have rub-ons. So this, I'm gonna turn it a little bit so that the light doesn't reflect so much. This is a 12 by 12 sentiment rub-ons. So these are um, provided in large and smaller versions. You can see the smaller down there for your different size projects. And on the back here, you can see them all. Let's see, there we go. So you can get a good idea of what's in there. It's nice to have some nice large rub-ons for an instant page title. Then we have our regular 12 by 12 rub-ons. And again, I'm gonna flip it over so you can see the whole image. We've got lots of sunflowers and leaves and chickens and ducks, roosters, and some bees. This is a new sheet that I was trying for this collection. It's called Color Wash. And what's really fun about these is it gives you a painted background or a painted edge to kind of lay under your images. You can see the full design here, kind of tilting again so that you don't get the light reflection so much. It's hard with the plastic to not get that. Whoops, let's see, okay. So then we have our regular six by eight rub-ons. So the six by eights come with six different sheets and they've got sentiments, sunflowers, Roosters, chickens, clusters, chicken wire textures. You see all those in there? Lots of sentiments. An essential pack, as always. All of the rub-ons are really essential in my world. Okay, then we've got the chipboard set, which is bits here. And I'm gonna open this so you can see. So we've got like little book plates and if you punch out the center of the book plate, there's a sentiment in it. So we did that for all the book plates this time. And lots of, we've got our geese and chickens and roosters. Whoops, am I getting those in the camera? So you can see all those and butterflies. Really wanted to amp it up with our chipboard to have more icon images. I think they're just so fun. And here's like a little bouquet. Another thing in our chipboard is I've put some tags. So they've all, you have to punch out the center part, but you've got four tags here. And how fun are these with the chicken wire? 
and the advertisements and black on white chicken wire and a botanical. So there are 63 pieces in this pack. Another must have item, really everything for this collection. You're gonna want it all. It's just so fun. Look at this little heart. It's just so cute. Can you see it over my fingers there? Lots to love, okay. One of my favorite things is coming up though here with the laser cuts. Get these all back in the bag. All right, oops, wait, before we get to the laser cuts, we've got our chipboard words. There are 59 pieces of chipboard shapes. So you can see all kinds of scripts and then word strips too. I'll just open it to show you a couple. These are a nice, it's a thinner chipboard, but it's very sturdy. And there is not adhesive on the back. So it's a little bit more flexible what you do with it. But a definite must have, whether you're using them with countryside or anything else. The words are really versatile with kindness, amazing, home, best, good, curious. I can, there's just so many different possibilities with that. And then we have our countryside tags. Again, these already have the grommets and the strings attached. And there are 18 different tags in here, a mix of small and large, and definitely essential. All right, now we've got our laser cut. So we've got two different laser cut packs. We've got our laser cut elements, and we've got our laser cut wildflowers. So I'm going to show you, I've already punched out a lot of these. And one of my favorite things in this laser cut pack is the chicken wire. And I'm just gonna indulge myself and show you how incredibly awesome it is. Check it out. Can you see? Maybe I need like a, I need something white. Let's see. Look at that. This chicken wire is so cool. It's super fine detail. And there's two pieces of laser cut chicken wire. So let me get the other piece. And they're both different, different shapes. So you can see that one. And there's even barbed wire in here too. I mean, how fun is that? You So many different things you can do with these. An old bicycle. Laser cuts are so much fun. And in the element pack, there are 82 different pieces. Like we've got like a little wooden frame. You can see the bow in here, tickets, fence post. There's a few botanicals in here too. And then when I go over to the wildflowers, there are 95 different cutouts. And that's huge. Talk about getting your money's worth. So look at that, the intricate detail in these cutouts. It's crazy. It's so fun. And just imagine all the different things you can create. And the sunflowers. We all love sunflowers. And the leaves. Look at this branch. I could probably use a hundred of those. Love it. And lots of butterflies. Definitely a must-have. I can't wait to start seeing what everyone is creating with Countryside. It's going to be amazing. Okay, and then for the ephemera pack, 
I've already actually taken it apart, but I'm gonna just show you, we've got our back side here of the packaging. So you can see all the different pieces in here. There are 102 different pieces in the ephemera pack. I've got clock faces and file folders and ephemera tickets. Look at the little flower cutout, sentiment spots, and some big page titles too. I think, what's not to love, really? I love this. How cute. The bee on the clock face. The tickets. Little farm postcard. Everything for your day in the country. If you've got like a county fair, or if you just go to visit the sunflower fields. I know we have a lot of sunflower fields around me. And I see people posting them from other places too. All right, so that is our ephemera. Now, a couple other things to show you for countryside. Is, let me grab this. Oops. Because of course I have it open because I can't use it enough. I'm so in love. This is our chicken wire washi. Can you see that? Four inch chicken wire. 10 meters. Okay, look at that. That is a lot of chicken wire washi. How awesome. Can you just imagine the different uses? I've been using it in my art journal. I could see it as binding. I could see it as just making your whole background with it. You can paint it, color on it. Super fabulous. I think that's gonna be a stash go-to again and again. And then we've got our repositionable fabric tape. And there are four different rolls and each have five meters. So we've got our main large roll here with the floral design and the sunflowers. And then I did one with Bees. So this is a half inch roll with bees. And we've got our chicken wire on black. And again, this, um, the fabric tears if you cut it ahead of time. Oh, I guess I didn't even need to cut that but it'll fray nicely and it's always fun to tear. Makes for more organic. And then we've got our usual solid with a nice green for countryside. So as I wrap this up, a couple of things I wanted to show you of our other products that go so nicely with countryside is our new lace washi tape. This one in salsa goes so nicely with countryside. It includes three rolls. Whoa, that was not good. Let's see here. Uh, you can tell I'd already played with this. So I had torn it and I hadn't kept my edge. So there we go. All right. So you can see it's a nice painted lace. And there's two different kinds of painted lace. One's a little heavier than the other. Let's see, this, this one should go a little bit better. And there's the second design. And then the last roll is uh, a skinnier half inch roll which is great for ed edging, see it? Just a messy painted trim. All right, and then of course, we've got our ticket rolls that go lovely with this. We've got the red from Salsa, and I've been holding my rolls together with a little piece of washi. 
But look at that. Those will be a great addition to Countryside. And you've also got Sunbeam. Those tickets will look so nice. And then we have Fern, which has almost like a chartreuse green in it. So look, when you have these three colors together, right? Countryside, it says countryside perfectly. And then you can add pewter to have a gray. Really, who doesn't need all the things, right? I need all the things. All right, well, thank you for joining me for checking out Countryside, and I hope you find it at your retailer and are able to create all kinds of projects. All right, if you like what you see, be sure you like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so that the next time I post, you'll get notified and can share some more exciting products with you and smart journaling too. All right, have a great day. Thanks for watching.